update video time. So the first thing I want to talk about is um, what I'm doing in terms of Call of Duty. In terms of Call of Duty, because of the new patch that came out on Black Ops 2, which I'm sure most of you know about, but just in case you don't know, the DSR and the Ballista both got nerfed. Um, their fire rates are slightly slower, 0.5 uh, seconds slower. So the DSR went from being a, you know, one shot per second to, um, uh, you know, 1.5 uh, shots per, or no, uh, one second for every, one shot for every one and a half seconds, geez. Um, and I don't know what the ballista stats are, but yeah, they both got nerfed, so um, I've decided to stop playing Black Ops 2. I just, it's not fun. I've been getting fed up with it anyways, and I was planning on quitting and making a video quitting video for it, but I've decided that I will give Multicod a chance. Um, I'll, I'm going back to Black Ops 1, and I'm going to try that. I've been grinding out all day today, trying to get to level 27. It is not easy leveling up on Black Ops Black Ops 1. I mean, I have been going hard. I've been getting like 30 to 50 games every game, getting chopper gunners and playing the objective, getting at least four or five caps every game, and I'm still lucky if I rank up once in a game, and I'm only level 25. So hopefully I'm going to try to get to level 27 tonight, and then tomorrow I will uh, see how I feel about the sniping, if I like it, if I don't like it, you know, what's going on. I have a feeling that uh, I'm going to be more inclined to use the PSG1 because the L96 is really laggy and I've seen some people using it um, and I picked it up off the ground and I used it a little bit and it's not um, you know with the connection on Black Ops 1 it's not really all that fun to use but uh, you know when you can't land your shots and everything it is fun to use and I think once I get adjusted to it it'll be better and I'll be able to hit clips and stuff so anyways uh, the other thing uh, that's going on is me and my friend Franco are planning a dual -tage. Um I pretty much have all the clips I need for it. Uh, Franco only has about three or four clips right now, so uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to try to get like ten clips each um, and, you know, send it off to an editor. Um, I have a couple people in mind for the edit, but uh, it's going to be tricky to get them to do it, you know, because a lot of editors... Um, in the community, and, and a lot of, everyone in the community is really selfish, and, uh, you know, if you ask them for anything, they'll be like, oh, I'm busy, and really, they're just too lazy to do it, so, um, but I know, uh, that there are a few people that are legit, and if they tell you they're too busy to help you out, they really are too busy to help you out, and me personally, that's, you know, what I, if somebody asks me for some GFX stuff or something, I, I'll, I'll tell them, I'll be like, um, either I'm too busy, um, or if I'm not busy, then they have to have some sort of idea, because if they don't talk to me, and they're only asking me for GFX stuff, then I'm not really going to want to put a whole lot of effort into doing their design, so the least they can do is give me, um, you know, a way to go with the design, so I don't have to sit there for an hour trying to come up with something creative, original, and cool, um, but, yeah, so, um, yeah, I'm planning the dual Taj with Franco, and we're looking for an editor. Uh, I have a couple people in mind, and um, so that's pretty much it in terms of Call of Duty. Um, but in terms of GFX, I have a couple things that I want to announce. Number one, I am starting up a new series. I don't even know what it's going to be called yet, because I just came up with it a little while ago. But basically, the idea behind it is I'm going to do as much GFX stuff um, over the course of three days, Friday um, Saturday and Sunday, as I can, and, uh, since I can't do, uh, speed arts, um, what I'm just gonna be doing is just taking gyazos, um, of the stuff every, like, um, I don't know, like, 15, 20 minutes, and, you know, just making it into a nice little, uh, video for you guys, and I, I think you guys will really enjoy it, um, uh, and it just seems like a cool idea, but, that's just going to be the first episode. After that, what I want to do is maybe do something where, like, people comment in the description and they come up with, like, uh, two ideas of, like, something really cool that I could do with, you know, in terms of GFX. Um, and then, like, the top two or three comments 
um, I will contact those people on Skype, and I'll be like, yo, those are really cool ideas. I'm going to go for them. I'm going to try to do them this weekend. Um, you know, all of the ideas they mentioned, so it would be, uh, you know, or two of the ideas they mentioned. They can mention more than two, but at least two of the ideas they mentioned. Um, and then on top of that, since they had the best ideas, I will also be giving them, you know, one free, uh, you know, whatever they want. If they want a logo, uh, YouTube banner, Twitter, uh, you know, whatever it is, I will be doing, uh, you know, something free for them in terms of GFX on top of the two ideas that they gave me. So that's a total of um, like, ten, nine or ten different GFX designs, um, in the course of three days, which, you know, if you're, if you do GFX, that's a lot, that is not easy to do, um, to do ten really original GFX things, so I think what I will do is, in terms of it going on my portfolio, um, I'll probably make, like, a, a new, little folder on my portfolio and it'll have like the series name and then it'll do all of the things I've done for that series. But um so yeah, and then the last thing I want to announce is um when I get to 100 subs, I will be doing a GFX giveaway. I will be doing um all of the, you know, textures and color corrections and effects and all that stuff that I use as well as um some text that I really like some brushes that I really like, um, and some, uh, some templates that I use, my own personal templates for Twitter and YouTube and stuff like that, so be looking forward to that, um, if you, uh, if you're a beginner GFX and artist and you really need some, uh, you know, textures and stuff, then send out this video, send out my channel, and get people to start subscribing, because the sooner I get to 100 subs, the sooner you get your free GFX packs and all stuff like that, so, uh, thanks guys for watching, um, uh, just a quick, uh, recap, Black Ops 2 is gay, so I'm moving over to Black Ops 1, uh, me and Franco are planning a dual Taj, um, starting up a new GFX series where I just do as much GFX stuff in three days as I can, and, uh, at 100 subs we'll be releasing a GFX pack, so, thank you guys for watching, hope you enjoyed, like, comment, spread the video, and I'll see you guys next time.